da 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 Come for the White House. Who is Hello. That? Yeah, I know. <laughs> I'm full, y'all. We just had dinner. I'm a little full right now. She drank all the wine as well, so you see, this is all I got. Real tiny speckle. Okay, what are we talking about? We're talking about wine tonight. Huh? <laughs> Hello there. Let's try to start this again. We're a couple of winos, and we are going to talk about this wine tonight. So, which one is it? This wine is called Mac Murray. Estate Vineyards, and it's a Pinot Gris. So why are we talking about this? It's white wine, and we don't really do white wine, but this is a 14.3% white wine, which is worthy to be discussed. Another one from the Russian River Valley. The last review was on a wine from the Russian River Valley in the Sonoma region, I believe. Yes. Yeah. So. What do you want to say about this white wine? Uh, it is exquisite for white wine. Um, as we said, we, we do drink white wines, but we are more prone to drink reds. Um, myself, uh, I gravitate towards more red, um, even in the summertime. But this was a, this was a really solid um, white wine, um, Pinot Gris wine. Um, I tasted apricot and I got some really nice um, peach notes to this both on the mouthfeel and also um, on the smell I like to smell it and uh, yeah it was really it was really good we had what do we have sausage tonight with spinach spinach with um, polenta really hearty nice hearty meal but it was very light um, and the wine was very uh, tart, a little tartness, so they, they worked well together with the food, so it was a really great pairing, great job tonight. I really appreciate you. Well, very nice. So yeah, no, this was a very good wine. 14.3, um, I feel nice and mellow, um, but very, very smooth, with a little bit of sweetness too, so yes. really balanced. So definitely uh, felt the sweetness, so don't like really dry white wines. Um, but also don't like those syrupy sweet, like um, super sweet Moscatos and things like that. So this was something like really nice, nice, nice in the middle. That's how you know it was good when you start slice nice, nice. <laughs> it was nice and it was not sweet, but it was sweet. Anyway, <laughs> it was good. It 14.3. Uh, um, definitely we are having a good night. So it did the job. Um, it did go well with the foods. Um, I taste, it had like a nice butteriness to it, nice texture to it. Um, you could pull in those fruit flavors, but it really went well with that polenta, which was nice and buttery and fatty and full of carbs and all those kinds of things. So it's a good pasta kind of wine, kind of wine that you, you know, you put that down, that keto down and you come back to it the next day because the food that you're going to eat with this, is going to um, fill up your belly. So at the end of the day, we know we don't do a lot of white wines, but this is worthy to be on the page. McMurray Estates, yes. Pinot Gris, 14.3. Of course, we got it from our favorite place, which is Total Wine. Total Wine. It's Total Wine, send us some free stuff. I'm just playing. Total Wine no, is great No, we're not store. playing. Send us free stuff. Um, we're out. That's yeah. about it, right? Yeah, it was good. It was good. Um, not too complex. What, was it Tadao for you? Yeah, a little to down, you know, whatever. And, it's, a, uh, it's a Wednesday night. It's, it's good. empty. Yeah, we're working on the weekend. We're going to get to some more stuff this weekend. But yeah, very good. Well balanced. Um, Yeah, like I said, pasta. Um, but it also works well with uh, fish if you want some lighter fare. But very versatile white wine. Um, we recommend it. Yeah. So, yeah. That's Couple our... Couple out with an empty bottle. Bye. Peace.